everyone, this is Moritz for Tira and we're live from CES 2014 and we're with um, the company called Huawei, which we've seen for quite a while now on the smartphone market, but they're still trying to get like kind of a foot in the door in the Western countries. And you're trying to do that as well with a new smartphone flagship device called the Ascent Mate 2 4G. So Scott, tell us what's different than the Ascent Mate 1 uh, and what are other special features that you built into the Mate 2? Well, it's, it's chock full of features. You know, the, the main thing that you're going to notice right off the bat is the screen size. Um, How it big is, is it? It's a 6.1 inch, okay. um, and it's IPS, so it's an LCD screen. What's the resolution? Uh, Full HD? 1280 by 720. Okay, all right, yeah. cool. So, um, you know, it's really bright, vibrant. You've got great camera quality on here as well, so you can take great pictures and then you can enjoy them. So you've got a 13 megapixel camera on the back with nice. LED flash. Uh, you got a 5 megapixel camera on the front, so that's, oh. that's relatively uh, a relatively new feature as well. So with the five angle or the five megapixel camera, you're going to be able to take wide angle pictures. Mm -hmm. So like you could do like a panoramic shot selfie if you wanted to, okay. for example. So you're kind of focusing on the user group who wants to take pictures of themselves with a exactly. front camera, which most other smartphones only have a very bad resolution at. Okay. Right. Cool. Yeah. So what other uh, stuff can you tell us about the specifications in terms of the the processor um, in there and the RAM size sure. maybe? Sure. Uh, the processor it's a 1.6 gig uh, quad core processor okay. and that's it's Qualcomm all right so um, you know it's really quick really fast responsive um, as far as the battery life you also heard on the PowerPoint that's that's a really long battery life with the 4050 milliamp battery as okay. well and talking about battery life you also mentioned one other feature which I thought was quite unique you were able to charge other devices with the SMA 2 is that right right because the battery is so strong you know through the uh, the charging port on the bottom you can buy an accessory to plug into another device to charge it, it okay. Okay. it's so long. So it's the same port, I just plug in my other smartphone, tablet or whatever USB exactly. device I have and yep. can charge it? Just through the bottom there. Alright, yeah. pretty impressive. Pretty can you tell us anything about uh, when this device is going to be in stores or how much it's going to cost? Um, no, I can't speak to pricing or where it's going to be available yet. Um, it's coming out this year, 2014, so that's about as all, all we know yet. We just don't know where. Okay, alright. Thank you very much, Scott. Thank you.